All right, so I'm playing uh, Silent Hill 4. Uh, let me turn off my... I'll keep my air on. Keep my air on, I guess. I was going to try to play Digimon World, um, but it also doesn't work on my PS2 90,001, the new black PS2 Slim, which is uh, very upsetting. Because I have a PS1, I have a PS2 Slim, I have a second PS2 Slim, I have a PS2 Slim Pal, and I have the PS2 Slim 90,001. And Digimon World doesn't work on any of those, which is super upsetting. Is this an energy drink? No. What's this? Just like I thought, the power's blown. Let me turn my air off. Yeah, so... Obviously, I have to return it to eBay. And eBay was like, oh, like, you didn't return it before the day. I was like, I don't, I don't know why you're rushing me. Like, I know you guys only keep track of your, your purchases for, like, three years. And... Like, after three years, it's not there anymore. And you also get PayPal credit um, when you sell something, which you could then use to buy on eBay, dis different discounted items on eBay. I'm going to go put my items away, actually. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it just so happens that, like, I don't know. I was like, dude, like, I, I was, I actually happened to be busy that week. That week. I'm, I'm not sure why you're sending me broken products like I, I really don't have I really don't have time for that like I, I could walk but like I, I ended up getting a second Digimon world at the time and that one didn't work as well and then I also got another PS2 slim and I was like all right well maybe it'll work on another PS2 slim and it didn't so you know like i'm i'm not in a rush to and also like they don't give you the receipt thing right away which i guess all the the weirdos who sell products on ebay are aware of it's like oh yeah you don't get the return label right away you have to wait for them to give you the return label so then you log in on like your parents computer and obviously like there was like one virus where like they call you and like you could just sit there and you'll be like yeah like here's all the computer information and you're you're hacking our computer right now and it's totally fine so i mean if like a speedrunner who plays like resident evil wants to be like oh like digimon world is so great and then everyone's buying digimon world and the game doesn't work Because they have a new Digimon game coming out, so I guess now's the time to sell fake games or whatever. I'm sad that I don't have the the stun gun for this area, but that's totally fine. I was watching this on my, my iPad before my workout before. Like, I, I just prioritize jogging. And like in between sets, I would run up the stairs, IRL. And what I would basically do is. I would uh, line up my PC because it would go to sleep. So like I would line up my PC. I could put it so it didn't fall asleep, but I don't want to do that. So I was lining up my PC. So when it fell asleep, that it would just continue like pulling all of the data like I want. Because there is like, I don't know, like 800 different things to pull, so. All right, so this is the guy from the room in the eye hole. So now the room's kind of expanding. Uh, and 
Like there's other areas besides the room. I don't know why this guy just got knocked off the building. Did his tie change? I didn't even look at his tie. No, it's still the same tie. It's a nice artwork tie. Like, I think that's kind of odd to have like a tie like that, you know? I wish I could have like a tie like that, kind of. I don't know. I've been enjoying my books. Looks like this guy has a sword of some sort of in his chest. There's a weird s sword stuck in his stomach and he's holding something in his hand. Take the item in his hand? Yes. You got the ghost's key. The key that the ghost is holding. Okay. There's a sword stuck in his stomach. Take it out. Yes. You got the sword of obedience. Extremely rare sword. When used against down ghosts, it stops them in place. When pulled out, the ghost is revived. Nice. That's kind of odd. So I just use like the ghost key on like the very simple boring door. So it's like they they kind of just like took the room and looks like there's just like slugs and blood. It's kind of odd, right? She's like melting, melting snow. It's a golf bag, but there's nothing inside. It's a golf club. Looks like a five iron. Take the five iron. No. I'm pretty sure he leaves that there. I'm going to take the bat instead. I'm going to take the aluminum bat for sure. It's way cooler. Because, like, I saw him. He was, like, swinging the bat at, like, the, the monsters. And he looked way cooler, I thought. Kind of like a One Punch Man Season 2. The guy with the bat. That fights the huge centipede. I mean, season two of One Punch Man isn't particularly cool, but that is a great episode. Watch this, ready? That's not what happened in the video. There we go. Hell yeah. Watch this shit. Yeah, the aluminum bat is dope, dude. Look at this shit. Hell yeah. Watch this. One, two. Oh, so I mentioned before, um, sadly, my my game audio is too loud. But so these dogs, it looks like their tongues are fruit roll ups. Am I right or am I right? They have huge fruit roll ups hanging out of their mouths. Let me go grab this first aid kit. I didn't even see him pick this up. You know, I'm going to leave that there because he didn't pick it up himself. It's enough cat food for an army of cats. Will you take the key? Yes, you got Albert's sports key. 
Alright, so I'm just gonna run back up. He goes over in that door and he looks at He looks at like a rusty clock kind of thing, but then decides like, yeah, like I don't need to go that way. Um I don't know if it bears any significance later on, but yeah, near that cat, there's another another door. Near that dog, there's another door. Alright, so, you use Albert's sports key. This is a nice and simple area. I really enjoy the lightness of the PS2 controller. Gosh. So this part I have to be careful. I had like a really good, uh, like it was an average dog, but I mean I, I, I ran up and down the stairs a few times, so whatever. And I walked all day yesterday, so... And I've been getting my jogs on. Could be better, but... Could be... I think he goes behind here, but let me try this, yeah. This area's kind of cool, because it kind of looks like... Metal... It looks like Metal Gear, too. So this is kind of cool. This is like the elevator area. I mean, in Silent Hill 3, that the elevator kind of looks like it's a, a mix between like some type of valve and fire and like a nurse like character getting constantly dipped in like hell as a part of like theater. All right, so let me go back up. So the guy in the YouTube video here, he actually pressed the bottom button and uh, he like ran around and it ended up, I, I think the bottom button doesn't work. So then he pressed the top button. He didn't actually run around, I lied. So there's a, there's another sword right here and a spade. And then after here, I basically need to, I need to go somewhere and I'm not really sure where. Um, and then I'll be able to, it's a large spade, take the spade, yes, you got the spade. Spade. Ordinary spade, like a construction site. It looks like it would be an impressive weapon. Some kind of strange sword. Take the Sword of Obedience. Yes, you got the Sword of Obedience. I don't know. It feels like at this point, like, all the characters are kind of, like, floating around and stuff. Like, just, like, carelessly. Like, he's ascended past, um, like, traditional Silent Hill. All right, so here's where I'm kind of unsure. I'm like I, I'm not sure if he goes down. I'm not. I'm not exactly sure how to how to like finish this area. Here, I kind of forget. Pretty sure he just leaves. I need to get down there somewhere, somehow. Thank you. 
I'll just go back. That guy wakes up under a fan every time, uh, like Pyramid Head, in Silent Hill 2. No letters this time. kind of cool you get to like kind of i guess be pyramid head maybe Pretty sure there's like an umbilical cord in like one of the Resident Evils. Or Evil Within. I forget. Let me read this guy's note. There's a scrap of red paper stuck in here. It's stained with blood and I can't read it. You put the superintendent's memo into your scrapbook. All right, so I guess at this point he can't really write well or whatever. Let me put some items away, I guess. Sort of obedience. Ordinary spade. All right, I guess let me let me check out over here. See how it's going. All right, just the bunny, whatever. All right, so I'm just gonna save and end. I actually got my uh, Silent Hill Origins today, which I'm pretty excited about. It's the prequel to Silent Hill 1. So yeah, I'm gonna end stream. Oh, return from building world. That's cool. So I guess they have like this like world where you could like go into buildings and stuff yeah i'm ending